Uh, this Schloss, it means uh, the castle. So this is Castle Oberhoven on, on the Lake Thun. On the other side is the uh, Interlaken. This, in this cage they used to keep the last virgin. <laughs> well, virgins don't last very long with the nobility, I guess, eh? <laughs> A bunch of rapists with their prime noctus, the first right getting their pharaonic genetics all over into us and um, I'll probably see some things here when I look at it later well that looks reptilian like on top what's that? ah the sun hieroglyph around the neck and uh, well let's have a look so there's the lake you can see the lake there and to the left side is Thun, and to the right side, Thun is on the lake, and on the right side is Bern. Here are three rings for Isis, Horus and Seth. There's also three, three sort of pyramids here. And this here is the uh, Fleur d'Elys, the symbol of the aristocracy one of the symbols. Oh, that's fascinating. This is the symbol that um, I think Osiris is, is having on his head. Yeah, that's Osiris. Oh, there it is. I'm sorry. It is Isis, of course, with the sun in the middle. And this, this is Osiris. He's got the thing here for the circumcision on his head. So you can see that the aristocracy, the nobility, they are the pharaohs. That's where they went to. And this is why the Europeans, they have so, many, so much pharaonic genetics in their blood. So you saw that the nobility at the castle uh, in Switzerland here and here you can see it uh, on her head and it's all uh, it's all a, a matriarchy it's all female dominated you know it's all about Isis and Seth or Sethon or Satan oh, he's the guy who well, says us all and Horus that's Jesus they're, they're, I mean that's us well he's not in this picture uh, it's man on a cross. He can't move his. He, he can't. He can't defend himself. It's forbidden because he got his hands spiked to the cross. He can't run away because his feet are nailed as well. You can just nod his head and say yes, darling. No, darling. Yes, eyes is no eyes is yes, Mister Judge. I never do it again. Well, what did I do in the first place? You know. So there it is, Isis, on a Swiss castle. You find it everywhere, especially in Switzerland. Well, the name means Isis. It's from the French word Suisse. It means sisters of Isis, Suisse. And it became in German Schwitz, Schwitz, Schwester Isis, and finally Schweiz. But in English, it's still very near to the Swiss German pronunciation. The Switzers, or Switzerland, like Schwitz. Uh, as in German they say Schweiz, so actually the English pronunciation is is far more nearer to the original. So that's Isis on the castle. That's Madonna. They all showing the Isis thing, yeah. The horns on her head. Oh, that's Isis. There again. So Isis cult. All oh, the eyes is called pop stars. <laughs> it's all nobility, it's eyes is cult. So the guy just told me I have to pay 10 francs. Well, I suppose they're, they're rich enough, you know, so why should I pay 10 francs? Hmm.
the Swiss Serpent. The world is gonna know what you did, you Swiss Serpent, you snake, you Swiss snake. I think this guy has an octagon t-shirt who's working here. Probably calling the cops because of me. <clears throat> they call the police because of nothing. Hey you Swiss snake. You Swiss serpent. What do you do? What do you do to the world, eh? We know you are a bunch of serpents. I am Swiss, I'm driving a Ferrari, you know. It's too quick, well I think it's octagonal. I know, he's part of the gang, you know. There you are, Swissy, and one day the world will know how you Swiss rodent have been gnawing at the pillars of our of world peace of humanity. And the world will find out what you've been doing with your banks and your mercenaries and your octagon thing, financing Hitler and the First World War with uh, the German Emperor. You've been gnawing at world peace all along. Smiling through your teeth, eh? And one day you were lying with your feet up. Up in the air. Swissy. The world will know what you've done to us. To mankind, you parasite. What was that? Phoenix with some reptilians there? That's <laughs> charming. Yeah, they, wanted, they wanted me to pay 10 francs. So I told them, uh, you know, if you already got all the, the, the Nazi gold, so why should I pay? And she, she said, well, the others did it as well, you know. So yeah, well, we stopped Mr. Hitler. You financed him. That's what I said. Bastards. Yes, well, you know, actually, I, uh, I lost my grandfather, you know, in the Second World War fighting the Nazis, so... Well, that's, that's where the Virgin was looking out, probably. As long as it lasted. So there's the castle. Here's the lake. Somewhere over there is Interlaken. Still snow, it's in August, in the summer, August 2014. Snow never goes away, eternal. Uh, a lot of places to hide stuff, eh? Even the uh, the look, uh, even this has been made like a sun hieroglyph, you know. Oh, they really like to go into details, eh? What's the serpent? What's that? And of course, this is the uh, the bear, like in John, the uh, the beast. Is this the beast? I tell you, the Swiss wing witch. There's some reptilians more. So this is the entrance of the uh, of the castle. The outer wall, and then there's an inner wall, 
and another wall and another wall is like going into a Swiss bank and trying to find your, your safe where you have your Nazi gold. Eh? So this is the uh, the beast, one of the bear here, Switzerland, like in the Revelations. This is some pharaonic stuff, probably papyrus. The goat, the crescent moon with the nobility. Like um, they're not really sure if they're really Muslims. It's like being in a Freemason lodge, you know. It doesn't matter if you're if you're a Muslim. Or Christian or whatever it's it's the same stuff anyway uh, only the difference is you know if you go to the Catholic Church or the uh, the Jesuits there's a far larger amount of uh, of pedophiles as in uh, as in Islam or or the Jude the Judaism or Buddhism or uh, Hinduism which is a typical Catholic or Christian thing, you know, to rape children. So, well, here's the, there is a castle, and this is a, uh, a uh, kindergarten. Mm. Whoa, 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 whoa. In the next sequence, there's a slip of the tongue. Uh, I wanted to say that the, the, uh, the male line died out, of course. But, um, I said the female line died out. Well, that, that almost never happens. Not in the Western world, it does. So, the male line died out. And that happens a lot. You know, the problem with kings and royals, you know, they can't find a male line. And actually, the male line died out, you know, because Egypt is very feminine. And if the, uh, the female mind is more dominant as it is in the West, which we can see happening, the more and more females and less and less males getting born. Because the whole society, you know, you get like uh, oppressed here if you're a male. Unless you're like a garden gnome and they always say yes darling, no darling, like Mr. Jesus on the cross, like. And uh, who can only move his head, you know, so you can only nod his head and say yes darling, no darling. This is really the symbolism behind it. Uh, you know, this is the... Uh, uh, the Black Widow, well it isn't, but I mean it fits in the story like. And um, so you can see it in the couple, like if the, if the female is dominant, you know, you, you, get, you get little girls. Even if the guy pretends to be like a macho like. But if it's the, um, if it really is the male, like in Muslim countries, it's uh, more men getting born, statistically. So it, it's all in the mind, it plays a real role. So in the end they lose anyway, you know, just because they don't have any more man. So, like it says in the Bible, the first will be the last and the last will be the first. And this is really happening especially with the nobility. They got all the power and it's really female-led, it's Egyptian. Because the, uh, the pharaohs, they became the aristocracy. And, uh, which was the only civilization in the antiques. There was very uh, female domina dominated, a uh, met metri metriarch met metriarchy. Difficult word. Okay, well I can talk ages about it, but I just wanted to tell you it was a slip of the tongue. I meant to say that the the male line died out. So here it says they were the, the uh, from the castle. They were the the free lords of Oberhofen of the the upper court and uh, somewhere in time the the, um, the female line it died out uh, the sisters of Isis it's always the same here Swiss services the, the female line died out there you can see the Swiss Templar yeah. with the bear bear Three things, Isis, Horus and Seth. Was that a dragon? And the, uh, the Templar. It's related. So this is about 2,000 feet above sea level. Yeah. 600 meter. 
Oberhalb vom, vom Meer. So the water is here, but still it's uh, it's like half a kilometer over the uh, over the sea level. <laughs> well, that's good for pirates, eh? Swiss pirates. So even palm trees here. That's uh, snow. Pyramid. <laughs> snow in August. Swiss neighbor was testing his machine gun just around the corner. <laughs> 